Welcome guys, this is Phone Tech here. Today I am going to show you how to use your Samsung SM7000. First thing you need to do is head to your settings, system, about device and uh, tap on the build number a bunch of times until you get the option that developer mode has been enabled. Mine is already enabled so I don't need to do it again. Head back to about device, click on developer options here. Please check this GW debugging mode is checked and uh, this also is enabled from here. Now this thing you need to do on your device. After that you need to go to this particular site https dot slash slash dot chainfire dot eu copy this website note it down search for your particular model in my case uh, my model is SM7000 so I will search for that model and please match the build number of your model with the same auto root file which you are going to download here <coughs> this is my model SME7000 right guys and uh, this is the build number KTU 84PE7000 ZSU1A AOB1. Please match this with your build number so you won't have any issues. Your model number is this SME7000 and your build number. Click on download. When you click on download, it will take you to this link. Now you can see this link here CA Auto Root. Click on the link and your download will start. Once your download is starting, let the file download. And once you have finished download, you need to head to your head towards your device and put your device in download mode. To put your device in download mode, you need to click uh, press the volume key down button, the home button, and the power button together, all three at the same time. When you press all three buttons at the same time, you will get let me show you the volume key down button and the home button and the power button together. And when you press all three that you will get something like this. All these three buttons together. This home button and the on button together. Okay. So first this button, second this button, and this all three buttons together you will get an option to develop a mode. This is what the screen you will get. Warning installing custom. Volume up is continue, volume down is cancelled. You need to press volume up. Once you have done that. Uh, once you put your device in this download mode be sure not to disconnect the USB cable and head towards Odin run as administrator press yes now select the root tar file from here make sure auto reboot and F reset time is checked click on PDA and click on CF auto root press open See, since I am not connecting my device, I have already been rooted it. You will get a message. Uh, this thing will highlight in blue. Add it. Once you have done that, it shows your message. Add it. Click on start and just wait. Wait for a couple of minutes. Don't do anything to your device. The device will reboot and uh, it will show you that installing Android is upgrading. Let it upgrade. Let it uh, do things together don't fidget with the device or anything and uh, after that wait for a couple of minutes the device will restart once your device restarts you will uh, I'll show you once your device restarts 
let the device restart don't do anything with it you'll get a message passed in odin once you get that message passed in odin then it is safe to disconnect your device now head towards yes this you'll get a sign super su okay now to verify the root status of a device you can head to play store and download the app root checker root checker just download the app install it this just to verify that your device has been properly rooted guys that's all when uh, you install this application you will get a message that congratulations uh, congratulations your device has been rooted that means you have rooted your device successfully thanks for watching my video please like and subscribe to my channel it really helps me a lot signing out for the day phone tech have a good day you see verify root just click on verify root grant permission congratulations root accesses properly installed okay guys enjoy your root take care bye